just sink the shit to like a damn like What's going on guys, this is JJ Frank 01 and today I kind of, you know, was watching a little bit of YouTube, came across this ad and it kind of pissed me off. It's an ad by Forcefield, iPhone parental controls made easy. So pretty much they're just, you know, very, let's just say not the brightest adults out there that don't know how the internet works and don't trust their children and don't want to develop at all. The moms are stalking the kids. Let's get into it. Okay, check this out. I can see all of my kids' browsing activity on all their devices from my own phone. So as you can see here, it has Facebook, it has Netflix, it has canacademy.org, Team Nick, and Team.tom. I don't know what Team.tom is. But what they're expected to see is Pornhub, RedTube, furryacademy.gov and teamflickbeans.com So they're not going to be the most, you know, the best things parents want to see. But, if they want to be spying on the kids and the kids don't know anything about it, they're going to see a lot of porn on there, they're going to see a lot of fucked up shit. I mean, they're kids. What do you expect them to do? They're discovering themselves. Alright! Calm down. You loud. I can see all the photos they're posting on social networks. I can turn off all the apps, games, and social networks on their mobile devices. So not only are they spying on what they're, you know, writing, what websites they're going in, they're also spying on the pictures they're taking, which is a little bit creepy. And if not, you can just add your child on social media and you'll be able to see it. You know, you may not be smart enough to know that your child can block you personally, but still have your friends so that you won't see their picture or anything they post. But it'll relieve, you know, a little bit of your mind and shit. And this goes against... Th doesn't this go against cyber... Cyber policy? I don't fucking know the name. I But I thought everyone had a right to have their own privacy. Fuck is this? How, how is this legal? During homework, when they're sleeping, or when I just want them to go outside and... She made all the apps disappear? She, 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 she literally took away every app on the phone that isn't already installed. Well, let, let's see what apps. It's on their away. mobile devices during homework, when they're sleeping. She took away Facebook. I don't know what the other one. There's a lot of apps. I don't know. I see Spotify. I can't see this. Text is in the way. I think that's Angry Birds. And just watch. Just watch. Or when I just want them to go outside and poof. All gone. All gone. This isn't even fair. And why does she have her phone on when she's sleeping? That can burn you. Like, to be a great parent, you need great tools. You are not. Don't give me this bullshit. You are not a great parent for doing this. You are an untrustworthy, paranoid son of a bitch if you do this, pretty much. Oh, no, oh, no, 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 no. And force field? is the essential parenting tool for the digital age. The essential digital tool. Digital tool? The essential parenting tool for the digital age. How about you just learn the basics of technology? You know, cause pretty much what you're doing here could or couldn't be illegal. Do people have a right? For their own privacy. Fuck. Can't. I'm fucking illiterate. I can't spell. Essential parenting tool for the digital age. Force field. Fuck you. You're a bunch of bullshit. There's a reason you only have 78 subscribers. Look at the like and dislike ratio. 21 parents agreed with this, while every other person who lives on the internet disliked it. 
And let's think about this for a second. If the parent doesn't know how the internet works, and this is the parenting essential for the digital age, how the fuck are they going to see this? It's not like they're going around watching YouTube videos of PewDiePie or Jacksepticeye or I don't, I don't fucking know, Unbox Therapy or someone like that. Maybe Unbox Therapy he is really universal. But it's not like, it's not like they're going to see it. Now let's read some of these comments. See what the internet has to say about this. Anyone who uses this app is a stalking, overprotective freak. Christian, you fucking nailed it. How to get your kids... How to get your kids to wish you were dead, 101. Fuck you to any parent who gets this app. I, okay, this next comment I really agree with. Make, they're making a really good point about this. I know parents care about their child... But I think this won't help. It'll create conflict between the parent and the child. Plus, this is just stalking. Let's be honest. Who came just to dislike the video after seeing it as an ad? To be a great parent, you need to respect your kid's privacy. I see a lot of comments here targeting the actor who's playing this. I don't I seriously doubt it's her fault unless she's the one that made this app and everything, but... I'm pretty sure you shouldn't be hating on the person presenting it if it's most likely an actor. Hashtag crazy white bitch. All right, let, let's be honest for one second. If you're getting your, you know, your child a phone, you're pretty much just saying that they're responsible enough to know how to handle a phone, know what's on the internet. So if you're restricting them from using the phone, you're pretty much just like giving them a plastic piece of, you know, maybe metal, depending on what kind of fucking phone you got. But if you don't trust your children having a phone with what it has in it, they just don't give them a fucking phone. As harsh as that may seem uh, now that we're on the internet age, but if you're going to be so fucking crazy as to be doing this, not only that, I read the description right here. Click here to put those force field parental control for iPhone on the test free for 30 days. So you not only have to not trust your child, but you then have to pay on your second month. And that's not, and that's even if you didn't watch the ad. There's probably a lot of parents out there paying for the ad without even knowing about the first 30 free day trial. So not only are they not trusting their child, they're doing it in the worst way possible, and they're paying for it. You could easily take away their phone for free, and that's it. I don't know, I, I, I just wanna make this video cause this legitimately did piss me off a bit. But hopefully parents don't, don't, fucking don't do this. And... We're a fucked up society. Alright guys, that's gonna be it. Not a fun video obviously, a little rant, but if you guys enjoyed the video, I recommend you go to this link, thumbs that shit down, and I mean legally that's all I'm about to say. You can do more if you want, but I'll see you guys later. Yeah.